<laughs> we are living the dream, man. But at least now I know whose phone I need to use if I need service. Yeah. Is there a time delay? No. I don't, good. I don't think so. I mean, we're an hour behind. Talking to the boss. That's what I'm saying. Like, you guys are an hour behind. Like, oh, yeah. I mean, it's not well, time zone. So. Hey, you have fun too, man. Okay. I don't know how Bryson's phone has service. He must have some. Oh, there he is. Bryson! Hey, how do you have service? Yeah, I got service too. Really? Yeah. Well, Jason just called. I had a lovely conversation with him. <laughs> yeah, he's got full service. Yeah, he's got full service. I literally have no bars. Like, nothing. Oh, when you guys all have service, I don't have service, so like in the middle of a town. In the middle of a town, where everyone lives. Come to this house. Everything's looking good. All the bikes are set. I think we're good to go. I just need some more coffee. That's about it. Let's do a last minute check. We're ready. Hey man. I'm back. Baby. I'm in the house. Well, what's, how's the Eminem song go? Back again. again. Shady's back. Katie's back. 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 Tell a friend. Slick out there. That's good though. <coughs> practice the break in. Pretty uh thing is getting blown out, but solid practice. That's fun though. I like this layout more than when they had that, that on the steep uphill, they had a triple step up, uh -huh. hard in the rollers. That was fun. I feel okay. I didn't totally suck, so that was a plus. Um, I'm just not I'm not super comfy, but um you know, I'm here and I'm uh, gonna try and stiffen myself up a little bit and uh, see if we can gain a little bit of traction. Let's get after it, dude. Oh. This track's fun, this track's fun. I felt good. We're still we're still messing with suspension, dialing suspension in, figuring stuff out. But we'll get it. You know. All we can do is just keep trying our best every weekend, you know. That's what we're doing, that's what we show up and do. Everything is good, we're just gonna go over the bike, make sure all the bolts are tight, make sure nothing falls apart. 
send it back out for the next, uh, get ready for the next moto, get some mud off of it. It'll be good. Dude, I've been on this level for freaking days. I can't figure it out. Look, I don't know where any of the colors are. Like, what am I supposed to do? This is my, brain, my brain's struggling. We're okay. It's a little frustrating when AMA doesn't give you everything you need to see where your rider is. Just waiting to see my fate. <laughs> Just landed halfway on a berm, halfway off a berm, and went over the bars. Just sand stuff. Stuff that happens in deep sand. Just damaging myself. Constantly. Uh, we're just replacing the uh, handlebars. We had a uh, little bit of a spill in the second yeah, qualifying, so I'm um, just going to oh, replace yeah. these bars. They were just tweaked a little bit, but just that little bit could be enough to really throw them off for the rest of the day. So we're just making it 100%, and then uh, we're going to get them back out there for the main events today later. faster right there I was probably like three seconds and then once yeah. you got out front yeah I, yeah I don't understand that I gotta get man can't qualify for anything and then go out there in the LCQ and put a gap on. yeah I got the win in that so I mean that was good not the way we want to do it but I just felt way better and flowing a lot more that time had to have been a couple seconds faster so I, did. I don't know I just got to figure out this qualifying thing man really
I almost crashed. I took a bar to the gut in the back, trying to catch my breath. And I looked down and my bike was overheating for some reason. So I pulled off, but it is what it is. You know, I'm just, you know, gonna go do more laps and do what I can do. I just feel my 30 minutes plus two, man. The great outdoors. As inside the top 20, the whole moto. Running uh, pretty much 19th, 20th, and I was in 19th. Whole moto, I was right on hand, and uh, I think it was Miller for 18th and 17th. I was right on him, and last lap, my bike did something really weird before the finish just caught out, like it almost ran out of gas, or I thought it blew up or something. And then all of a sudden I started it, and started right back up, I lost the position. So, um, P20, Moto1, <laughs> I, I gotta be happy with it, because I mean, for where I've been, that's, that's pretty good, we got another point. But, you know, we can do more. And It doesn't even, I don't even have to blame my fitness for me pulling off. Broke two things. You can blame Dan. Yeah. Happy to be here. I rode, I rode okay, and I didn't die. I mean, you talk about, it's just, it's, it's beautiful. When you see a guy like that before, he's got the flow. If you got the flow at the line, you're gonna have the flow on the track. Oh yeah. <laughs> example of why a rider should not work on his motorcycle. I'm juggling tent. I gotta make sure I'm fed, hydrated, relaxed. I shouldn't be touching suspension clippers, evidently. But it worked. I don't know, I was around B22, 21, moving forward, and then went down, hit neutral, fell back to, I don't know, 28, I think, on the pit board, and got back to 22, so it was a good ride. I rode good. We went to the line with a flat tire. Then, yep, and then uh, came back just in time. Got it switched out. Got him back. Got back going again. Second moto was up there on the start. I was like, I came out around 13th, made some passes, got into ninth, and then I passed Anderson before the 
uphill, took the very inside, came out of that, and it's like, I hit like a fucking banana peel and just about 360 up the hill. I'm like doggy paddling up the big steep hill and just went backwards. Lost all my spots, all my momentum. I couldn't even jump the first double, so. Like I went back to way back, like probably 20s by that point, and then recovered from that, and then like two or three laps later, about ate it again by the mechanics or you heard a gnarly kicker, a hand went off the bar, got some major swap, but we saved it. And that's like all of a sudden it just like hit me and I was just I was done after that. But keep building, keep building man. Set the right direction, better weekend for sure. You can say I'm back, I guess. Uh, two DNFs. But it was okay. I mean I knew I wasn't gonna be super strong coming in. Um, but I did I did the laps that I for sure wanted to do, but hold off, we were having a bit of a bike issue you today just I got beat by a guy who thought he was adjusting his rebound adjusting his compression unbelievable <laughs>